Hey guys, welcome back to ED Figure Unboxing. If you're brand new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe and like the video so you won't miss the future content. And in this video, we're gonna take a look at the SH Figure Arts Comrade of Grease from Comrade of Build. And Grease is definitely one of my favorite characters. I mean, I like everybody in the show, but he is definitely on my top three. Um, I don't necessarily like the writer design, but I really like the actor though. Anyways, um, here's the left of the box. Here is the right of the box and here's the back of the box. And this gold packaging looks really nice. And I pre-ordered this guy a long time ago. It just got stuck with another order in Japan. Anyways, um, let's bust this thing open and see what we got. And here we have the figure still in the inner packaging, looking beautiful. And let's check out the figure itself. Alright, so here we have the figure itself, and as expected from SH Figure Arts Kamen Rider line, the figure is beautiful. And let's just take a closer look at the figure. Um, everything is very nicely painted and sculpted. I especially like the translucent plastic over here. I think this turned out really, really well. And the metallic gold is really, really nice, and we have all this attention to detail. Um, yeah, just look at all this. Really, really beautiful. Of course, we have the driver here, and he has like the gold liquid here. Whereas um, Dragon Jolly has blue and Rogue has purple. And yeah, um, I think we can jump straight into the articulation. And for the articulation, let's quickly go over it from the neck down. He can look up about this much, look down about this much, and you can turn his head no problem. And the shoulder does have a pull out method, um, and we do have um, ball joint over here. You can raise his arm up about this much. We get a hinge and a ball on the shoulder pad like usual. And you can actually move this. Um, to perform the final attack where like he has oil coming out from here and then we have bicep swivel you can curl about this much and you do get the ball wrist and for the ab crunch you can bend forward um, about this much bend backwards about this much some really good side to side movement for the leg we have the pull down method kick up about this high bend about this much thigh swivels side to side pivot and toe hinge in terms of articulation it's basically exactly the same as dragon jelly if you have that one but yeah um that's it and let's check out the accessories and for the accessories first off we get a pair of the swivel pin hands and these are very nicely painted and sculpted and then we get one right hand for him to activate his driver and lastly, we get a pair of hands to hold the Twin Breaker, and this can go into gum mode and assault mode, of course. I'll just play around with this. And we also get the bottle for Robot and Phoenix, and these are done very, very well. And yeah, I believe that's it for the accessories, and let's check out some action poses. Anyways, that was just some quick posing, and I hope you guys enjoyed them, and let's check out some size comparison. And for the size comparison, let us start with some Comrade Bill figures, and of course they look amazing together. And at the time of this video, Tamashii Nation just announced a bunch of new prototypes at their show. Um, they have Rabbit Rabbit, Tank Tank, Prime Rogue, and the Three Crows. Um, I don't think they're gonna make Three Crows, but if they have the courage to make it, I have the courage to buy it. I am such a big fan. And next up, we have some good old Dragon Ball SH Fig Arts. And then we have some Naruto SH Fig Arts. And I'm not sure what's gonna happen to Naruto, but I think it's pretty much dead, right? Some Mesco 112 Collective figures. And then we have some American IP SH Fig Arts. And lastly, we have some Figma figures. And let's jump straight into the final thoughts. Alright, so for the final thoughts, I am a big fan of Comrade of Grease. I don't have anything bad to say about a figure, and I highly recommend it. Beautiful paint work, amazing sculpt. It looks like he walked out straight from the show. And yeah, um, I think that's it from me. Do let me know in the comments on what you think. And this is Eric. Don't forget to like and subscribe, follow me on Facebook and Instagram. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace.